Okay. Hello, back from the home of the bot. Bought myself a couple of things, damn it. Bought myself some biscuits. I want to try an experiment later on, and I bought some scroll saw pin end Ryobi specialty scroll saw blades. Hook tooth, regular tooth, and skip tooth. We'll see what what's what here. Yeah. Fits all scroll saws taking five inch pinned blades. See back application. Okay. Hook tooth can do two inches. Regular tooth half an inch. Skip tooth half an inch. Okay, well that's good. So gouda cheese. Anyway. Okay. Hopefully this thing's recording this time, son of a beaver. Justin Beaver. Hopefully it's on me. Turn it that way a little bit. Am I in the shot, boys? Am I in the shot even? All right, I'm going to go over to the... I thought I'd check 4x4 four four, any kind of wood this for Hellery, right? Jeez Louise. It's like for cedar, it's like 30 bucks for a 10 4 by 4 by 10 foot. It's a little expensive. Hey, a little bit just to try something. Good grief. I don't know. I'll have to get some pallet wood somewhere or something. I don't know. But anyway. So, yeah. Uh, maybe go to the bank and check. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh, uh. Check balances here, see what's what. See if my unemployment check went in there or not. We'll see what's what here. Oh, look at that, the green light. Got the green light of life. Look at that. Oy. Anyways, I want to talk to you guys a little bit about this, all this crap that's happening, all the FTC, COPPA, all that junk. Hmm. I don't know about that. Because, uh, you know, I can't see, in my opinion only, I'm not an expert on this crap at all. Oh, damn it, I gotta get in this late. I'm not an expert in this crap at all, but I, everything I'm seeing and listening to and checking out and all the things, different people talking about different things it seems to me like they're gonna get come down hard on the big guys not so much the little guys because little guys ain't making any money you know what i mean we ain't making no money good grief thousand and under you ain't making any money unless you got affiliates and sponsors and all that horse shit but i don't know you know what i mean I don't think they're going to screw us all over, but it's hard to say. Holy, this place is busy. God damn it. Well, maybe we'll wait on that. Jesus. So many busies. Sheesh. Yeah, I think I'll just park over here for a minute. Uh, wait it out here. Holy. Ah. Anyway. So many peoples. Anyhow, I don't think, uh, you know, the little guys, okay, follow the rules and do all the things and... <laughs> Sorry about the awning. <laughs> but follow all the rules and do all the things and make sure you click the little, on your videos, just click the little thing. And I know a lot of people are going to say, oh, but I've got like 2,000 videos. Oh. Just do it, man. That's all. Just all you got to do is do it. It's pretty simple, straightforward. Just click the little button, save it. Not for kids. There you go. See, I don't know. I, see, this is the thing I don't understand. Is because 
my content, like I don't have a lot of videos, okay? I've got, I think I've got 385, but I'm not 100% sure that's how many I have, something like that. And um, right from the get-go, like I, 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 my channel wasn't even active for the first little while because I didn't know what, what I was going to do. I just wanted something, right? But I didn't know what I wanted to do. So I decided a little bit later on, I think it was like a year or maybe two. I don't even know. But I had the YouTube channel for a long time and I just didn't do nothing with it. Then I decided to do something with it. So then right off the snap, I started marking it um, age restricted 18 only, 18 and over only. I've marked that since the beginning of the freaking, since I started making videos. So now I go into the thing and it says not for kids. And then there's an advanced setting on the bottom of it. And it says uh, uh, it's not for 18, it's not for under 18 or it is for over 18 or whatever. But the, the way they're wording it is 13 and, and above is that old. So I'm not checking those ones off. So I don't know what, I don't know. But here's my thing. I don't think they're going to go after the ones that are making the money, you know, the cha-ching, you know, the big money. I don't think they're going to go after little guys because little guys aren't making any money. Like, okay, fine, some of them are, but like, I mean, if you're a thousand and under, you're making a little bit. You know what I mean? Like, you're not making a whole, you're not making, I don't know, one of the big guys. So, oh, you know all the big YouTubers, for God's sake, so I'm not going to name names because then I'll get in trouble. Ha! But, you know, I'm just, like, to me, I don't know, it just doesn't seem logical to go after the little wee tiny guys. Like, I can't afford to pay a $42,000 fine for each infraction. So I'm working my, every single one of my videos not for kids, right? But the thing I was listening to, the guy today, the different thing, one of the creator or whatever guys there from YouTube, um, he was saying it's subjective because they can look at your stuff or the bot that's going to be looking at all these things is subjective to, like if you have cartoons in it or if you have music that the kids like or whatever. So it's like, huh. Okay, so now do I have to change my beginning music? Because it's on my channel, my beginning tune is a is a um, children's tune. I got off of the, uh, ah, what do you call it? YouTube Audio Library, okay? And it's kind of like uh, banjo-y, whatever, right? So now is that deemed for kids? Like, I don't get it. Like, there's so much weirdness and gray area and weird crap that I'm not really exactly sure where the hell. You know what I mean? Like, but I don't think we're going to have to, you know, small guys, like, that aren't making any money, that aren't monetized or anything. Now, I don't know if they can just take our channel right away from us or what. So my thing is, I'm going to try and get a... Actually, I should go there now. I'm in the, thing, in the right thing. Once I check my my thing over there, I'm going to go over to one of the stores back here and see if I can find a hard drive. But I'm going to get an external hard drive and hook it on to my... Whatever, it's not even a laptop. It's just like a tablet, laptop-ish kind of thing. And I'm going to uh, download all my videos onto it. I take all my videos that are on the thing and move them over to that hard drive because I don't want to lose my content at all, like completely, because if they decide you're going to take your channel, they're taking your Google account and everything. Gone, right? So it's like, hmm, okay. Well, that's not ideal. Because you kind of need your Google account to get into your YouTube account, I think. <laughs> uh, son of a bitch. But anyway. So I don't know. What the hell is what here? I really don't know. I have mixed uh, emotions about it. 
not losing any sleep over it, but <laughs> you know, <laughs> uh, it's just something to something to think about. I don't think we're gonna have to worry, the little guys that don't make any money. I'm just doing, I'm just doing it for fun anyway. Worst case, Ontario, I'm gonna get something else, go somewhere else, whatever. That's all. But put, put, post my videos on a different platform. I'm sure there's plenty out there that are gonna pop up now that all this crap's going on. I'm sure of it. So. Okay, it's cleared up at the bank here a little bit. So, I think we're going to zip, zip over there and just zip a zap -a Go over there and do the thing. The different things. Oh, let me go. Zip and zap. Woohoo. All right, go check my balances here. See if my unemployment insurance has kicked in yet. I don't know if it has or not, but. Well, we'll go and see, shall go and see, boys and girls, and people, everybody, women, men, women, chickens, everybody. Oh my goodness, all right. Under and in.